good morning to everyone i welcome you all class 3 evs yes students today we'll discuss about that is the new chapter modes of transport yes so this is the lesson number 14 yes students you know that is already you know that is a vehicles in your house is uh, we will see the vehicles and others on the road so so many vehicles are moving so those all you know that is vehicles you know that is two wheeler vehicles then uh, three wheeler vehicles yes so and also four wheel four wheeler vehicles also you know that is yes so for example for two wheeler vehicles that is bike and by another one bicycle okay and three wheeler vehicles will give a example for auto rickshaw yes four wheeler so four wheeler vehicles we give us so many vehicles for example car and bus yes so we know about vehicles yes so here what is the meaning of modes of transport yes so the meaning of modes of transport means here the way which people carried one place to people carried one place to another place is called is called modes of transport modes of transport yes so the way which people carried one place to another place so this is called as modes of transport yes so in this modes of transport we will classify in three types so those are those are land transport next air transport next water transport yes so we will classify in three way those are land transport air transport and water transport yes so students so uh, let's be going here so what is the meaning of land transport yes so land transport means the vehicles the vehicles vehicles which are which are move on which are move on the land yes so these type of vehicles we can call as land transport it means the vehicles are moving on land yes the vehicles are moving on land those we can call as land transport yes so what are the examples will give for land transport bus yes car train so these all are the example for for what land transport yes so next one we are see that is a uh, air transport so the meaning of air transport is the vehicles which are which are move in the air yes so the vehicles are which move in the air those vehicles we can call as what we can call we can call as a transport yes example for a transport is aeroplane yes so aeroplane is the example for what air transport and see next see here we will give for example for air transport so aeroplane next heli 
helicopter okay and next we are going that is water transport yes what is mean by water transport so what is the meaning of water transport yes students the vehicles the vehicles which move which are which are move on which are move on the water which are move on the water those we can call as a water transport so example for water transport is ship boat okay it's also give example for me okay so what are the example for water transport so example for water transport is ship and boat and what is the meaning of what it is um, water transport the vehicles which are move on the water those we can call as a water transport yes and so students this one yes so now students we can be classifying the what it is you will see the vehicles those are two wheeler yes two wheeler vehicles yes two wheeler vehicles how many are they and which are uh, example for two wheeler vehicles and here see so example for two wheeler is your motor bike then bicycle yes so these are the two wheeler vehicles and three wheeler vehicles so three wheeler vehicles are auto rickshaw yes auto so auto rickshaw can be given example for for what so we can give a example for three wheeler vehicles yes next one four wheeler vehicles four wheeler vehicles so we can give a example for four wheeler vehicles a bus then car yes so etc so these all are we can give a example for four wheeler vehicles yes and so students this one yes so next one here see you can understanding we need a modes of transport we need a modes of transport because of to travel one place to other place yes we need or not modes of transport we need because without vehicles how we can be go how we can be whatever you can go to the market or we can go to the one place to other place so we need a vehicles yes so if it is a near place we will be walk on huh? by walk we will be going so so if it is a far for us uh, place far that is so we can going on the vehicle only yes okay so here so next they can given here so in your uh, textbook they can given here one of the poem see here that is sing and enjoy picnic picnic by bus along with my friends variety of vehicles moving on the road horse cart and bullock cart cycle and motor bike auto rickshaw and and car so many vehicles on the road train and the rail boat on the water airplane in the air so flying in the sky some are moving slow some are moving fast so different modes of transport i like them very much so this song is related on modes of transport yes so this is related on modes of transport so here they can be given here so name the vehicles which are there in the poem so we now we see the this poem so in this poem which are the vehicles are there so horse cart bullock cart cycle motor bike auto rickshaw then uh, car 
train boat aeroplane yes so these all are the vehicles in the poem yes next one they can given here this is the collect the picture of vehicles and stick them so they can given here in the places you can be collect the different types of different vehicles pictures and paste here okay yes next one we are going that is make a list of the vehicles by which have traveled make a list of vehicles by which have traveled yes on the which uh, vehicles we are used to travel bike then car then bus train yes auto then boat we are using no these all are vehicles then ship then bicycle so these all the vehicles we are used to move on one place to other place yes we need our vehicles because of we are traveling one place to other place yes so now we are going to hear the classification of what vehicles by listed here fast moving and slow moving vehicles yes so now we will be classify fast and slow moving vehicles here see i'll write here fast moving vehicles vehicles here i'll write here slow moving vehicles yes so slow moving vehicles and fast moving vehicles i'll write here slow moving aeroplane sorry fast moving then next train next bus next car yes so these all are moving fast yes fast moving vehicles slow moving vehicles will write here bicycle bullock cart horse cart horse cart the next auto so auto rickshaw so these all are the slow moving vehicles these all are the fast moving vehicles yes aeroplane train bus car are there more but so i'll write only four here okay here slow moving bicycle bullock cart horse horse cart and auto rickshaw yes you know so more vehicles more of fast moving and slow moving vehicles so we'll write below okay yes so which vehicles are used for carrying goods yes so which are the vehicles we are used to carry the goods yes see we'll write here truck yes we use truck lorry then train auto then cars so these all are we are using to carry the goods okay yes so next one they can given here the activity that is for they can given fill in the blanks with the suitable words and read the passage so they can be given one of the passages they can given here and also fill in the blanks they can given here so we read and which one that can comes the vehicles will write in the fill in the blanks yes okay see we use vehicles like dash and dash to travel from one place to another place so we use vehicles like car and bus so to travel from one place to another place yes so people use vehicles like dash dash and dash 
to carry goods from one place to another place so here i'll wrote it okay so here so i already so show you so which are those truck lorry and train yes the next dash is the compatible for long journey yes if it is we are going to long journey so which vehicles we will selecting so we will selecting train that is very compatible for a journey then next dash is useful to travel fast to travel fast within an hour so which vehicles we will be used to travel fast that is aeroplane yes dash is used for traveling in desert in desert area the people are used to travel that is the animal yes that is what it is that is camel yes so in camel also we can call that is the ship of the desert what we can call that name ship of the desert which animal that is that is camel yes yes the so people use to, to dash to cross a river so they can be cross a river and which vehicles they are using so it means the people are move on the water so which which uh, which of the uh, what it is vehicles they are using that is ship or boat yes okay so they can given here students write what you have seen in the bus station of your place so in your place bus station what you are seeing so they can be mention some of the boats yes so and we will what they can be mentioning boards and how they can be keep a clean yes so i have seen in our bus station i have i have seen in the bus station so bus station of of my place it means in our place bus station what we will see so that is that is ticket counter is there no in the bus stand yes ticket counter the next uh, instruction boards they are also mentioning here and that place instruction boards and also public and public toilets so these all we will be see in our bus station in our place bus station yes okay so students they can be given here in the blank in this activity draw a simple pictures of vehicles two vehicles and you will be paint this okay okay that's your work and here see students they can be given here railway station yes so railway station what are the instructions uh, they can mention here are what they are on the board so here see keep the railway station clean yes so we will be maintain the cleanliness in our public areas yes okay so here see is there a railway station in your place students so, if it is there railway station in your area is there if it is there it will be right yes otherwise if it is not there in your place railway station so we will write no okay yes so in our place is there so i'll write yes okay have you seen railway station yes commonly all seen that is so i means you know that is already uh, traveled in railway also yes okay so so have you traveled by train so as yes. so all travel no if you are traveled right yes if you are not traveling in that uh, train so we will write no okay yes so here one of the activity here with the help of your elders prepare the model of train using a match boxes using a match boxes and lids of 
lids of soft drink bottles yes so students this is a very interesting activity so you will to try this one because it is a nice okay and they can given here there is a need of workers in bus and railway stations to different works yes there is need of workers so that means if it is workers are there in the bus stations it's helpful for traveling people yes so they can be uh, take uh, take a goods from uh, one place to other place bags yes so these all they will be take and keep a uh, one place to other place so their cooperation is needed for comfortable of travel so that who are a given cooperation for the people that the public so that is very helpful for the journey of publics yes okay so here they can given you observe the pictures observe the pictures what jobs or works are the people doing write it in the space provided yes so here see one of the boy it means one of the person is sweeping cleaning that area cleaning that area so this person we can call as a sweeper he is sweeping yes so he is called as a sweeper here is the one of the person he is uh, carrying uh, that is a uh, bags yes so carrying a bags so he is we can call as a labor yes or as worker okay so here see so that lady is travel it means it means drive a vehicle she is driving yes so what she can call we can call she is driver yes okay and she here in the bus so the person is giving ticket to a people yes giving ticket to a people what you can call here so we can call him conductor yes here see one of the person is riding the auto rickshaw what we can call him we can call him a driver yes Yes, students. I hope you understood. This lesson is completed. So tomorrow we'll start. That is new lesson. Thank you for watching.